What happened when your mom found out that her brother was, was helping her son to become a pimp? It was the thing. You know, it was the thing. You know, in the 70s, it was uh, the thing to... Uh, the pimp was the thing. He was the man, you know. Um, you know, it's, I, come on, man. You know, uh, San Pablo, MacArthur, and Broadway used to look like a fashion show. Right. Yeah. Back in the so days. Those the host roles. Black, in, in come Oakland, on, yeah. man. Talk to me, right. <laughs> so, I, man, I grew up right there, man, North Oakland. Mm-hmm. Between marketing and uh, 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 Martin uh, uh, Grove, mm-hmm. right? Uh, I, I think it's uh, Martin Luther King now in market. Oh, Eileen, right there down the street from the Old Tech High School. And uh, as a kid, that's he. The pimp was the hero. Right. Yeah. He, he had the best cars. Yeah, man. The best he, clothes. Yeah, he talked. The most there. women. Best Shiny jewelry. Hair. Yeah. Best hair. Yeah, you hate for him to leave the room. <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. So now you're starting to build up. Yeah. Uh, how big did your stable get? I think uh, Don Magic Wand said one is so close to none. Yeah. Um, you know, I always kept at least six. Um, you know, there have been times where I tried to get, uh, you know, um, a little more out of hand with it, but I like to stick with the five or six. Okay. And do they all live in the same house as you? Uh, it depends on if they got along with each other or not. Right, because fights start to break out. Uh-huh. Okay. And you had a bottom girl? Yeah. And she kind of managed the other girls in a way? or Yeah. What was the worst thing that happened in terms of girls not getting along? Fights. The fights ever get and, bad, and, and you know, lost some money and, and stuff like that. Okay. That's about it. Did the fights ever get bad, like shooting, stabbings, that no. that type of thing? Okay, you, you no. kept that under control. Yeah, no, it's done by choice, not by force. Okay, it might bump chest, break a nail in the process. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when I, when I talked to, well, I I read Don Magic Wand's book. Uh huh. Right, and and he talked about you know, a good amount of violence throughout his pimping career. Okay. And, and I asked him about that, I, you know, and he, he didn't deny it. He said, well... Yeah. Fighting is like a criteria. You know, it's like the jewelry, the clothes, and all that, the cars is a criteria. It do happen. It's part of the game. You know what I mean? Because you got to establish a certain thing. You got to establish some fear in that female in order to get that respect. You must establish that. And she's going to try you to see if you qualified to get that respect from her. So it's going to bring some fear. And, when, and, and what I'm saying is violent. You know what I mean? And, 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 it, and, it, and it's something that don't have to take place, but it do take place. Because you're establishing something here that I am the one that you listen to and believe in, and nobody else. And you know, like I said, when I had to fight the girl, it wasn't for money, you know what I mean? Maybe you left the stroll and I told you not to. You know what I mean? You know, when you violate certain things, you have to check them. If you do it, you know what I mean, verbally, okay, but in the pimp game, it don't necessarily work like that. You have to really put your feet down. Right, exactly. Was there any violence in terms of when you were pimping? You know, sometimes it required, uh, you know, a little movement. But uh, for the most part, man, um, you know, it was cool. You you got some women, you know, that would uh, purposely, you know, fuck up and um, just to see if you would do something. Right. And uh, I mean, but you know, you look at the game nowadays and look at what it was in the 70s, right? The bitch just pick up the phone and say, he hit me and your ass went to jail, right? You know, now, um, you know, you uh, you shouldn't dare put your hands on no woman um, for no reason, Mm -hmm. you know. um, That's what your mind is for, right? Yeah, to replace your hands and stuff like that. 
That's that's what that's all about right there.